Hello there my fellow fans, today's royal installment. Justice Samuel Alito hit out at the Duke of Sussex days after the royal criticised the overturning of the Roe vs Wade ruling, which since 1973 has granted abortion rights across the 50 states. Prince Harry, Justice Alito, joked, really wounded him with the words chosen in his speech delivered at the United Nations headquarters on July 18th. Speaking in Rome during a conference on religious liberty hosted by the University of Notre Dame Law, the conservative Catholic judge said in a sarcastic tone, What really wounded me, what really wounded me, was when the Duke of Sussex addressed the United Nations and seemed to compare the decision, whose name may not be spoken, with the Russian attack on Ukraine. In a keynote address delivered on Nelson Mandela International Day, the Duke warned the planet is finding itself at a pivotal moment, where people can either be inspired by the South African leaders, spirit, and keep on fighting or fall into despair. His speech came a few days after Vogue published a conversation between journalist Jessica Yellen, Meghan Markle, and feminist Gloria Steinem on the changes applied to abortion rights by the court. Revealing she had discussed the overturning of Roe vs Wade with Harry, the Duchess of Sussex added, his reaction last week was guttural like mine. Meghan also urged people to channel fear into action in the wake of the ruling. Asked if the court's decision could be seen as a canary in the coal mine moment for groups who fought to gain rights in the US, Meghan said absolutely. We saw it in plain terms with Justice Thomas's concurring opinion. This is a blueprint for reversing rights. The ruling is a signal about the future of same-sex marriage, contraception access and many fundamental rights to privacy. It feels like the, trip, the tip of the iceberg and is part of why people feel so scared. We have to channel this fear into action. We can start this November in the midterms. I know hearing that feels so repetitive, but we have to vote every time from local elections to state and national elections. That's it guys, more news. Thank you for watching, thank you for your support. Please do like, comment and subscribe for more. And goodbye for now.